Is your Samsung Galaxy touchscreen slow or unresponsive? Don't worry, we've got you covered. In this video, we'll guide you through several troubleshooting steps to get your touchscreen working smoothly again. Let's get your device back to its optimal performance. First, restart your Samsung Galaxy device. This simple step can clear temporary files, cached data, and refresh the system's memory, potentially fixing minor issues. Often, a restart is all it takes to bring your device back to normal. Clean your screen using a soft, lint-free microfiber cloth. Gently wipe away fingerprints, dirt, and smudges to ensure optimal touch sensitivity. A clean screen not only improves responsiveness, but also makes your device look and feel better. Make sure your Samsung Galaxy device is up to date. Go to Settings, Software Update, Download and Install. Regularly updating your device ensures optimal performance and minimizes the risk of software-related touchscreen issues. Test your touchscreen using the diagnostic menu. Dial hash zero hash in the phone app, then tap touch. Draw lines on the grid to check for any non-responsive areas. If you notice any issues, it's a good idea to consult a professional technician for further help. Boot your device into safe mode to check for problematic third-party apps. If your touchscreen works correctly in safe mode, uninstall any recently installed or suspicious apps. Staying vigilant about the apps you install will help prevent future touchscreen issues. Finally, perform a factory reset if all else fails. Be sure to back up your data before proceeding, as this will erase all your data and settings. If issues persist after a factory reset, it's time to seek professional help from an authorized Samsung service center. By following these troubleshooting steps, you should be able to fix a slow or unresponsive touchscreen on your Samsung Galaxy device. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more helpful tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.